So this time I wanted to talk about uh, how the cadence of your speech can help you build different types of rhythms. So instead of counting 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and, we can do weird things like say, uh, taco, pizza, hot dog, ice cream, taco, pizza, hot dog, ice cream. Um, and you can use the spacing of words to help you with your uh, with your beat. So if you wanted to do say three sets of two, we could just do taco, pizza, hot dog, taco, pizza, hot dog, taco, pizza, hot dog. Or if you want to do uh, two two sets of three, we could uh, pick words that have three syllables in them. So we could go tempura burrito, tempura burrito, tempura burrito. Um, or and you can use the more natural cadence of those words they might go tempura burrito tempura burrito so you can see that can add a little bit more flavor to your beats by spacing out the the rhythm in a way that matches natural with the cadence of speech um, and you can pick pretty much anything you just pick a, a phrase or a sentence or something and just start uh, banging it out in the drums so you go hi how are you hi how are you hi how are you hi how are you hi hi how are you hi how are you i'm good thanks 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 so you can see that can add that sort of swing weird wonky pattern flavor to your beats um you can use this to map out the polyrhythms as well so uh, the two to the three to two polyrhythm would be nice cup of tea so nice cup of tea nice cup of tea nice cup of tea nice cup of tea um, and then the three to four would be pass the goddamn butter pass the goddamn butter pass the goddamn butter so I find uh, using yeah the natural cadence of speech can come up with some really fun rhythms so give it a go and try try as many different weird phrases and weird ways to say the phrase as well. The same phrase can be said in different uh, different patterns. So that's it.